Hey everybody, this is Randy Santel and you're watching episode number 23 of Dinner is Served featuring the Hill Italian Restaurant in Springfield, Missouri. Alright, I cannot wait to start eating this delicious looking Italian food feast. All of what you see here is inspired by dishes you'd find in the Hill area of St. Louis, Missouri. Let's explain what we've got now. All right, today Randy is starting out with a half pound of calamari, a half pound of our toasted beef raviolis. We've got just a few breadsticks for him here today, our seafood bisque. Over here we've got our crispy fried eggplant parmesan, our crispy sea bass. We have a whole pound of spaghetti and meatballs, another pound of lasagna here. We have our famous homemade butternut squash casserole, some shrimp scampi. For dessert today, we've got our homemade chocolate cake, homemade tiramisu, we've got a cannoli, creme brulee cake, and a mixed berry crepe. Finally, Randy's got a homemade limoncello to drink. All right, Chef Angel Kim, the owner of Rorico Brazilian Grill, where we filmed a few episodes ago, he also owns this restaurant, The Hill, him and his team have done so much for the Springfield community during this time that it is great to support them again. So big thanks to them, but let's shut up and eat. One, two, three, boom. All right, gonna hopefully take a lot less time than I did for all that Brazilian food, but I am from the St. Louis area and I've been to the hill many times. So we're gonna start off with some of this toaster ravioli, St. Louis famous toaster ravioli. gonna have some of this eggplant parmesan while it's still warm. We'll just use our hands. Shrimp fettuccine. All right, this is the big part, the spaghetti and meatballs. Get these down, then it'll be all downhill from there. Three minutes in, but I actually have done a giant, like eight pound spaghetti and meatballs challenge down in the Hill area of St. Louis. To watch that video, the link is down in the description. I don't usually eat too much eggplant, but this is amazing, just like that baba ganoush was when I did that Lebanese food challenge. Gonna have some of this lobster bisque while I have some of this calamari. Big spoon time. some of these plates, have the rest of this eggplant parmesan, and then we'll do some of this fried fish, the rock bass. Anything parmesan is delicious, but that was yummy, so time for some fish. Now we're gonna do some of this butternut squash. I haven't had butternut squash in a while, so I'm gonna enjoy this. That butternut squash was amazing. It was flavored with, or it's got on top of it, a five cheese blend. So not only did I get all the vitamins and minerals from the butternut squash, but also calcium from the cheese. So speaking of cheese, now we'll move on to some rolled lasagna. Bread sticks are awesome too. Even better when they're hot. Before we do all the dessert, let's have some of this limoncello. Salute. Ah, oh yeah. We will start out with this crepe. 
which had, I think, a raspberry sauce on it. Mixed berry, ooh, mixed berry. Mm. Everything that can be made from scratch here is made from scratch, including these cakes and the filling of this canola. I only have my big four. Arthur told me I must try this, so we've got to. That is chocolate. Getting my blueberries, healthy fruits, as part of this meal, too. Last but not least, tiramisu. We're gonna one bite this. Salute again. Ah. Mm. 21 minutes and 11 seconds. So glad to finally get one done in under 25 minutes. Unlike I think the last five episodes took me over 50 minutes, but that food was so amazing. My top three from that meal, I really enjoyed everything, but I especially enjoyed the lasagna rolls, love the sauce on there, and I really enjoyed the five cheese blend on that butternut squash, along with how well it was cooked. And then for number three, I've gotta go with their fried striped bass. They dip and fry it here, that was awesome. So big thanks again to Chef Angel Kim and his staff here at The Hill, all-you-can-eat Italian restaurant in Springfield, Missouri. Typically, it's an all-you-can-eat buffet. Right now, they just bring everything you want out to your table side, but it'll soon be a buffet again. So technically, now that I've eaten all that, I could get more if I wanted to, but ha, I'm on a diet. So if you live around the Springfield area, definitely check out the amazing food and people here at The Hill Italian Restaurant. And if you don't live around the area, hopefully this video has made you hungry and inspired you to the point where you want to go out and support a similar Italian small business near you. Thanks for watching.